We really gotta do this with the mask on? Depends. Relax. I'm not trying to get my ass kicked by my nephew again. Your dad used to give me that exact same look. Kid? Martin Lee. Someone got him out. I know what you're thinking, Miles. This is not on you. We can't let him live up here. It's just another kind of prison. It's not that easy. Never said it was. But sometimes you gotta push the past away so you can make room for the future. That's actually why I call. Need your help getting something. Could get it myself, but... Parole means Prowler's retired. What is it? Just some old tech I gotta get off the street. Stashed it by a decommissioned Roxxon lab near Central Park. Yeah, I know the one. Are you really putting Prowler behind you? Behind us. You getting some? How did you... And Miles, that Lee business? Don't be stupid. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> wow. I was wondering what this place was. It's Emily's tree. This is perfect. You made it! I thought you said this was a startup. Yeah, I was hoping for something a little less... this. But my dad was the one who, you know, he made all the arrangements. Peter and... Parker! <laughs> so, what do you think? It's a far cry from that chop shop that Otto had you in. <laughs> and now that you're on board, this place is really gonna start cooking. Uh, Dad, Pete hasn't decided he's joining yet. Oh. Really? But I was gonna give him a tour. Let him... Decide for himself. All right. You know, seeing you boys together again. <laughs> right then. Have fun. Get your badge out. Let's go exploring. So the first thing I want to show you is downstairs. Harry, this place... Right? Dad went a little more over the top than I would have liked. How did you... Got things set up while I was still undergoing treatment, but when I got out, I made a few changes. Like what? Diverted my salary into research projects, installed a diverse board to keep us on the right track, and made sure all research aligned with our mission. To heal the world. First, I want you to meet Dr. Young, who's a leading entomologist. You know what entomology is? Yeah. Dr. Young is doing this super cool research on bees. Or, to be more precise, on bee predators. Uh, 
Here, follow me. That data does not cross tabulate with the AI learning that's in the last milestone. Ready to talk to Dr. Young? You must be Peter. So nice to meet you. I think you'll like this project. Great to meet you, Dr. Young. Harry says you're working with bees. Yes, and it's quite an urgent situation. A full third of the food you eat every day comes from crops pollinated by bees. But worldwide populations are in steep decline, primarily due to a significant predator. The carnivorous bee wolf. So, we developed an innovative way to help the bees. Want to see how? Whoa, this is cool. These little drones are essentially bee bodyguards that were training to detect and attack bee wolves. AKA, bee killer wasps. And you're helping with the machine learning algorithm. Do you see those little holographic bee wolves? The better you are at shooting those, the better our drones get at recognizing what to target. The idea is for the drones to scare the bee wolves to the them. Peter, a very productive session. We got great data. Okay, flying home. Welcome to the entomology. If those virtual bee wolves you just took out were real, you'd have saved the lives of about 2,500 bees. Wow, I'd love to help any way I can. I could take a look at juicing the neural network speed. Oh, yes, please. Maybe if Pete decides to join us, you two can talk some more. Thanks, Dr. Young. I've got so much more to show you, Pete. Let's go. Now, up ahead is the medical research area. We're doing cutting-edge proton beam work, using protons instead of x-rays, with better targeting and less radiation. It's all the stuff we talked about. All the stuff we dreamed could make the world a better place. That's the idea. <laughs> Harry, a moment, if you please. Uh, any chance it can wait a sec? It'll be quick. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Uh, Doc, this is my friend Peter. Peter, Dr. Connors. We've actually met. I used to work with Dr. Octavius. You came to the lab once to consult on electrotactile stimuli. Oh, yes. It's a shame about Dr. Octavius. His work had so much promise. Any changes since this morning? Dizziness, aches, pains, anxiety, impulsive thoughts. <laughs> nope. I've never been better. That's what worries me. Nice to see you again. Your doctor is the lizard. Dad believes in second chances. Hey, listen, I gotta go make a call, but uh, feel free to explore. Come meet me upstairs when you're ready. You really have a particle accelerator? We use it to send proton beams to that treatment room downstairs. It's being repaired right now, but I'll have it back up in no time. Where are we heading now? Up to the top floor. Your energy seems really good, Harry. I feel great. So put your way back helmet on and think back. Even before high school to middle school. Okay. Now, do you know the... Hang on. You're a popular guy. Sorry, it's just my tutoring job. 
You were saying? You know the stuff everyone studies in middle school with Gregor Mendel and the pea plants? Yeah, I think so. About genetics and plant hybridization? Exactly. So, Dr. Foster up ahead, he's won every top prize in the field for his work with plant genetics. Wow. Hey, when you were walking around, did you have a chance to feed the fish? No, I didn't. Oh, you have to. It's seriously one of my favorite spots in the whole building. So calming, and we're doing cool research inspired by the cellular structure of the koi fish's scales. I'll be sure to go check that out. And you see, if you let B be the base of the member system and end the degree of the root to be extracted... Mm -hmm. I see what you're saying. The algorithm is similar to long division, uh, if you look at it that way. Got it. Mm-hmm. Dr. Foster. Thanks, Dr. Foster. Ah, Peter, I presume. Harry talks about you frequently. So nice to meet you. Dr. Foster is working on agricultural efficiency. With the population growing and the climate changing unpredictably, we need to adapt more quickly than nature normally would. Genetic recombination can customize crops to best meet these new challenges, be it extreme weather or an increase in pests. Would you like to see this test bed? Okay. The idea is to tweak a plant's genes to maximize optimal qualities. For instance, a plant that can thrive in drought conditions. In our simulation, the goal is to maximize growth. Why don't you practice on this? Okay. Using this technology, we're on track to end world hunger by 2035. Wow. I know a rooftop you could use for a real world test if you're interested. Oh, very much so. Harry was right. You'll be a real asset here. Thank you, Dr. Foster. So now where? Last stop. Might be my favorite. It's commanding, but not overbearing. Playful, but not tasteless. Impressive, but not show-offy. Your office. Or is it our office? Harry. Now remember, the things you've seen today are just a small taste of what we're working on. Attention. But don't decide just yet. Not till you've seen this last thing. Okay. Come on, where's your badge? You'll need it to get in. Uh, where did I put it? Don't tell me you lost it. Nope, false alarm. Right here. Go ahead. Swipe. Wow. Man. Harry. This is all so amazing. It's perfect, really. It's just... Things are really hectic right now. When I was in treatment, all I could think about was, what would I do if I survived? And I kept hearing my mom's voice telling me that our planet is in trouble. And it's my responsibility to save it. If you join me, there's so much more that we can do. I mean, we both know you're the smarter one. <laughs> Come on. Let's make my mom and me proud, huh? It's amazing. But there's one thing. Can I move my desk over there? I like to face the wall when I work. <laughs> <laughs> oh, one quick thing. <laughs> I, 
I'm, I'm gonna need a little time to transition out of my tutoring job. Of course. Take whatever time you need. It's all about balance, right? Yeah. But Coney Island later, yeah? <laughs> you bet. Hey, sorry I didn't get back to you before, but I was... I just got a new job. For real? Well, that's awesome. Where's it at? This new foundation run by my best friend. It's... it's incredible. But I can fill you in later. What's up? The guys who took Lee and Scorpion? Genki and I tracked the exhaust trails from their aircraft to the Williamsburg Bridge. I'll meet you there. Hold on! Don't you have an essay to finish? Yeah, but... duty calls. Trust me. Your duty is to your future right now. I'll keep you updated on anything I find. All right. Good luck out there. Don't see any bad guys. Maybe Miles and Genki had it wrong? Hey, I'm at the bridge. But there's no sign of our mysterious safari pirates. Ah, oh, man. We were sure it was there. Sorry about the wild goose chase. Don't sweat it. We'll find him. Littering? Come on, man. at all? Maybe it'll lead me to some answers. Okay, Birdie. Take me to your nest. Up, up, and you won't get away. No, 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 no. Nice cloaking tech. Mind if I take a look under the hood? I'll take that as a no. That's two cloaks now. I wonder if I can get my suit to identify their visual frequencies. I don't see your boss around. Where's he hiding? I want to talk to him about his lifestyle choices. You are not worthy of his attention! But Scorpion is? Okay! Now, where's your boss? Another robot. Maybe I can test something out. Okay. Let's see. Sorry, Birdie. This is just as awkward for me as it is for you. There should be a... Yep. Oh, is that your home? Oh, come on, Bertie, let go! Come on! Stop buy a ticket for this ride! I'm gonna send this location to MJ. Maybe she can dig up some building records. Where are we going now? Hey, MJ. Did you get that location data I sent you? Yeah, it's an old food market. Owner died last year. Building sold a few weeks ago. Wait. This buyer. 
There's some shell company that's been acquiring property all over the city, like whole city blocks. I tried to do a story on them last month, but the trail dried up. Every person I was talking to just vanished. Go make yourselves useful. Our departure is imminent. Who are these people? I'm gonna find out. Good luck. I need to take these two out nice and quiet. And the rest of the hunters? Their blinds are all set up and communications have been linked. We're ready. What a city to hunt in. Gotta drop one of them away. Heard something. That's one. That was fast. You find something? Two things. This armed group calls themselves hunters. Connections. And they've got a lot of accents. Hmm. International mercenaries? That's what I'm thinking. Could be front page material for your article. I'm writing it up now. Thanks. Oh, and for speaking of work, I accepted Harry's offer. That's fantastic. We should celebrate later after you're done with your current work. Totally. Talk soon. It's like they're prepping for war. Two of the blinds have stopped responding. The spider has been seen in your area. Prepare the beast. Yes, that's close. Craven, that's their leader? Where did he... Take five. Where'd they go? <laughs> That's everyone. Now, what were they up to? Hello. Surveillance video from the blind I was just at. Looks like they've got others. All around the city. I'll send this to Ganky, but he could help pinpoint these. What's Craven hunting? Why? Yes, it's loaded. Well, you soon. Just make sure the beasts have the right scent. I want some hungry. You hungry too? <laughs> Sleep tight. Aw, for me? You shouldn't have. Oh, oh sturdy and flexible. Hmm. I wonder. Time to take my shiny new toy for a test drive. Surrounding bases are online. Remaining blind secured. Blocking feels operational. Good. Beatles. Looks like this is the only way. All right. Here to next. What is in that stuff? A research lab? Aunt May was so proud of her work at Feast. Lee broke bad in a big way. I just hope that doesn't mean everything he ever touched was corrupted. An inner demon mask. Lee's old superpower gang. Craven better not be trying for the same with his hunters. Hallucinogens. Probably the worst part of Scorpion's poison. If Craven's adding this to his arsenal. Ugh. That's. the Tiara Apitahi. 
One of the rarest flowers in the world. Its extract has some pretty powerful medicinal properties. I tried to get some years ago to counteract Scorpion's poison, but couldn't afford the flights to Riotea? Guess Craven could. Were they testing their weapons on that armor? Whoa! And not a single scratch? Almost an exact replica. Must have been probing it for weaknesses. Can never be too careful with Scorpion. Wait a sec. here on some kind of hunt. Craven the Hunter. What's he hunting? Whatever it is, it definitely involves Scorpion and Lee. Mind looking into this Craven guy in the meantime and letting Miles know what's up? He's already on it. Stay safe. All right, Craven. What are you looking for? Wait. Bringing Scorpion and Lee on a hunt, but Black Cat's a thief. I don't. Never gonna win best in show with that attitude. Nice doggy kitty robot. They're no joke! guys putting together quite the team. This the best you can do. They said you were a killer. Imagine my disappointment. supervillains for some hunt. They're his prey. 
Felicia. For what? En serio. My date's almost here and you're surfing the web? Ma, no one says surfing the web anymore. Uh, can you just please get dressed? Okay, okay. See, you got your good lipstick on. <laughs> you must really like this guy, huh? Miles? I'm sorry. Next time, I promise. I, Miles. I love you. I found a base belonging to those safari pirates, or hunters, as they call themselves, and learned their boss's name, Craven. And he killed Scorpion, and he's got a whole hit list of supervillains. Wait, what? Does this mean Lee? Don't know, but this list is extensive. These must be the people Marco warned us about. They were hunting Sandman. No way. And Felicia's on their list, too. Black Hat? Your ex? Exactly. She won't listen to me if I say she's in danger. But maybe she'd listen to someone she doesn't know. If MJ reached out to you with some addresses, would you be up for taking point on this? I got you. Thanks, really. I gotta clear my head for a bit, but call me if anything comes up and... We're going to find Lee, Miles. I promise. Hey, Miles. I have those addresses Pete mentioned for a few of Black Cat's safe houses. Head into the first one now! Thanks for offering to do this. Pete can get kind of blindsided by Felicia. I know you're busy with your college essay. It's cool. I always have time to Spider-Man. Sounds like you're as good at work-life balance as I am. I'm scrambling to finish my Hunter story. Might save my job. But you guys, with what happened to Scorpion and Lee and the Wind, I can't focus while he's out there, MJ. Don't. Don't let it eat you up. It might be best to just focus on the task at hand. That's not all. When I face Lee, I got some new powers. They're blue and weird. Uh, I mean, I'm no expert on spider powers, but... C could it be from stress? What you're going through, it, it's a lot. But you're not alone. Even Pete and I. We're still figuring it all out. One thing at a time, right? Come here. All right. Hey, Miles. What's up? Hey, good to see you. I can't believe Mr. Atlas is gonna be here at BV. Maybe one of those scholarships has my name on it. If he likes my sound. Miles, glad you made it. Oh, hey, Mr. Sinclair. I just love seeing all this innovation in action. Oh, have you heard about the chemistry club? They're filling in while Miss Ferguson gets ready to demo the new robotics drone. 
She's running late. Presentation's on the main stage. Oh, yeah. I'll try to make it over there. Enjoy the show. Thanks. See you around. Hey, Miles, over here. Hey, if it isn't Morales, the music master. What's up, Delisai? You here to see that university rep, Mr. Atlas? Yeah, definitely. Nice astronomy booth. Thanks. You should stop by later. I made a 3D model of Saturn, but get this. <laughs> it's cake. I'll save you a slice. Hmm, thanks. Hey. <sighs> you made it. <laughs> I want to talk to him about that computational physics program. We got your missing person report half an hour ago. What happened? That's just it. We don't know. She left to get something from her car and then never came back. I just heard two words, missing in person. So I'm going to say yes. Go ahead. We'll save your seat. Gotta catch up to the principal. Maybe I can find out more. from her fitness tracker. It's counting her steps, wherever she is. The students adore Miss Ferguson. I hope she's all right. Please find her. We'll do our best. Miss Ferguson's missing. Oh, man. Sounds like she's still wearing her fitness tracker. Wonder if I could find that signal. All right. Let's see where this fitness tracker is. Last known location, Dawson Harbor. Beginning text-to-speech call with Haley Cooper. Miles, Mr. Atlas just got here. ETA? Oh, man! Gotta find Miss Ferguson first. Be there when I can. He's handing out scholarship applications right now. Uh, can you get one for me? I'll do better than that. Sent you a link. Thanks. Good luck. And hurry. Hey, yo, Miles. What's up, Genki? Can this wait? Not really. I've got Mr. Atlas here. I told him how you were missing the fair for volunteer work. And he asked for a phone call with you. Is, uh, now a good time? Thanks, Genki. Now is definitely not a good time. Here he is, Mr. Atlas. I know you've got a flight to catch. Genki! Hi. Miles? Uh, yeah. Hello. You're whispering. Is now a bad time? Uh, no. I'll make it work. That's me. Great. I heard you're interested in our music technology program. So, tell me about yourself. What do you do for fun? Fun? Uh... Well, I used to do music production, but it's been hard to find time lately. Genki here showed me some of your samples. Good stuff. Particularly your song called Swinging. What was your inspiration? Uh, yeah. I was, uh, just swinging one day and thinking. Uh, the tune just kind of came to me. Interesting. And can you tell me about what's important to you in life? Being there for people when they need me. Being reliable trustworthy, someone people can depend on. Very interesting. And finally, why do you think you'd make a great addition to our school? I don't give up. And, uh, I care about doing the right thing. I won't let you down. Fascinating. Well, Miles, 
Thanks for your time. I think I've got enough here. Thanks. Uh, do you want my email so we can stay in touch, or, uh... <sighs> that could have gone better. Anything there she the is. RT this glass looks pretty breakable. Same six-step lock. Now help us unlock it, or we'll have to do this the hard way. I got you. Are you okay? I'm fine. But who are these people? How do they know I work for Rand? Let's figure that out when we're not in the hostage situation. Time to squad, Spider. You're dead, Spider-Man. He's ours. You hide. I've got these guys. <laughs> Kidnapping. How am I supposed to let that fly? yourself it's in my job description ready to go are you going to carry me sure I've carried people before as long as I can get verbal confirmation that if I throw up on you you won't sue me consider this confirmation just try to tell a brother first <sighs> Thanks to Spider-Man, our treasured teacher, Miss Ferguson, is back with us safe and sound. To show our gratitude, it is my honor to declare Spider-Man the official hero of Brooklyn Visions. <laughs> you are always welcome here, Spider-Man. Thank you. And now, back to the Quan. We've got a robotics demonstration to do. Not much time. Hi, Miles. I appreciate your dedication to interviewing, but I could tell you were clearly busy with something important. Mr. Sinclair put in an excellent word for you, as did Principal Evans. So let's do this right and meet this week on campus, in person. <laughs> Thanks, Miles. Science time. Crystal's all clear now. They say their boss is coming soon. And that he wants to meet me. I'm not waiting around. Sorry to break our promise, Kimi. But I'll tear this city apart. To find you. The hunters were after him. Marco was worried Craven's people hurt his kid. That's why he blew up. The crystal. I tried to be the best dad for you, Kimia. I really did. All I can do is hope they didn't hit you. And that you're safe at your mom's. I love you so much, Mia. We'll be together again one day. 
I know it. Hey, been calling you. My source at the raft told me Marco keeps repeating some address in Queens. Sending it to you now. I think you should check it out. Our moms. Maybe that's where Kimia is. Hey, MJ. You think you could patch me through to Marco at the raft? Hang on while I look into it. Okay, all set. Patching him through now. Spider-Man. Sorry for my... Well, the mess. Thank you. You helped me get my mind right. I'm sorry for not listening. Guess I never got to know the man behind the sand. But I think Kimia's at her mom's. On my way there now. If she's there, do me a favor. Give her those crystals. Something to remember me by. Of course. Take care of yourself, Flint. She's okay. I wish there was more I could do. Maybe I can ask some lawyer friends to help Marco with visitation rights. <laughs> 